This video is intended for mature audience only. Thank you. We're back with some horror, y'all. Hope you are ready. So today we're talking about Cobweb, a 2023 horror thriller film. Stars Peter, a shy, bully, eight-year-old boy living with his overbearing yet emotionally distant parents. Carol and Mark, he earns sympathy from his substitute teacher. Despite having plans to go trick-or-treating on Halloween night, so his parents basically don't want him to trick-or-treat or approve of it for the disappearance of a girl a few years back. So he starts hearing taps within the wall and he starts hearing a voice talk back to him through the wall and that's when the shit gets real tricky and this film is not overly gory or anything like that it's not a blood fest so you can't say i can't watch it because it's just a bloody mess this is a decent film in the 2023s you know the horror scene Caesar's ups and downs and this one delivers the story isn't so original that you, you haven't seen a concept like this done that you see in this film but to see it in you know the modern time and just the CGI or the graphics of what you're going to see in the film is pretty good to me. I like it. It's decent. I think they delivered what what they were trying to do with the horrifying um, feel, environment, if you will. The parents are odd as shit. So you're going to instantly pick up some bad vibes. Your spidey senses will tingle. <laughs> I think the characters could have been a little bit more developed. I think a backdrop on, you know, why the parents are the way they are and why they had to do what they had to do in the film. But, you know, the, the kid is eight years old, you know, the little boy is eight. But I would have loved a little bit of that. And the way the movie ended, I, it looks like they're setting it up for a part two. So, I don't know if they're going to do that, but I definitely could, you know, look in for that if anybody's interested in this film like that. But it's definitely a solid film. The horror is very traditional. It's not, like I said, overly violent. It's one that you could just watch with your your man or your, your woman and traditional horror to me is like you know a slasher film you know a good who done it who's killing people and the overly gore violent body parts missing and shit like that those are the more disturbing ones for me so when i say disturbing those are the ones i'm referring to so yeah i'll give it a thumbs up that was my quick review hope y'all enjoyed i hope y'all be safe out there thank y'all cobweb 2023 check it out when you got time y'all Ha 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 ha.